Hey there everyone. Before we get on with the video, please smash that subscribe button so you don't miss any awesome videos in the future and don't forget to like this video. Thanks. Enjoy the- Hey there! Today we are going to dye my hair. And before that, I wanted to do a reveal on this right here, my trichotillomania, because I have gotten a lot more um, comfortable with myself and more confidence, I guess you could say, even without makeup. <laughs> but I have more confidence in myself because of the messages and the support that I've been getting from my uh, followers on Instagram and stuff. Like my Instagram feed, my Instagram followers has gone up to like just over a hundred. Yeah, I know that sounds not very much, but you know, I haven't had the, the Instagram account very long, you know? I mean, I've had this channel for a while, but it took me like almost a year to even put up the first video. But um, here's my trichotillomania, y'all. I told y'all it was bad. Y'all probably don't know or think or realize how bad it is. But so there we go. Now, I just wanted to say I already mixed it up, this hair dye. By the way, I wanted to get this out of the way. But, um, hair dye is blonde with some cafe leopard. Because I have a pretty, super pretty wig that I want to use. And I just, you know, blondes, blondes have more fun. And you might not see the trick as well because I'm not going to shave my hair, my head, like a lot of people that have trichotillomania. And, um, well, because, yeah, even though I need to, that's why I cut my hair as short as I did. Because it was very, it was like to here, I guess you could say. But it was all different lengths from where the hair was going out. But this is what color, what I'm using. But, and I have, about to burp. <laughs> Anyways, I have, um, red high, um, highlights, black lowlights. And using this developer, I'm not sure exactly how it's going to turn out, so I'm kind of excited. Very excited. So, I'm not using any, I don't have any makeup on because I just took it off. I looked pretty gorgeous, I might add. But, um, yeah. Here's my trick. It's like the, this is the worst I've ever had it in the 22 years that I've been pulling it. Here, watch. Does it hurt? But, um, you know, I don't have any eyelashes either because I've been pulling those since high school because I thought, I was thinking one day in class, um, I have a lot of eyelashes, might as well do it. I keep, I'm, I keep looking at my camera or my video feed instead of the actual camera itself and I know I need to be doing that for eye contact. But, um, I don't know. It's kind of feels weird. Um, but, anyways, yeah, it's, it kind of looks weird. It doesn't, you know, it doesn't really seem to be that bad. Just, like, looks like I have just, you know, a little bit missing up top. But I'll show y'all exactly how bad it is. Keep looking at the camera, Elizabeth. Anyways, I'll show y'all how bad it is when I flip my head upside down and you'll see exactly what it is. So. All right, so I dyed my hair not too long ago. I guess you can kind of see like exactly how long ago just because of the, the roots. <laughs> this looks so funny. You know this, what this reminds me of? That Christmas movie, the claymation type, I think it is, Christmas movie, mu uh, movie, with that, um, the fire dude who doesn't, you know, I don't remember much about it at this moment because I forgot. If anybody knows and can think about what his name is, y'all need, Burgermeister is what I think it, why, I don't know why Burgermeister keeps going in my head, but I know it's not that, so, um, please leave me a comment if you know what that is. The Christmas movie. I, I just. 
I just don't remember much. But um, look at that, y'all. It really looks like it. And you can kind of see um, like how bad it is because like there's no hair there, you know. But you know what I didn't notice is that like here, I'm, gonna, I'm getting back in front of this so y'all can kind of see it with the difference. But um, like look how. You know, this is like more of a reddish color, y'all. And then this is like more of the wand. I'm gonna zoom in for you. Look at that. Isn't that funny? <laughs> Anyways, I'm kind of excited to, to, to um, see what this does, you know? Because I'm using um, a developer stabilizer thing. It expired. But, um,. Cannot wait to see what it's gonna do to my hair. Anyways, but um, I'm using my phone. But I have this really pretty wig I'll show y'all at the end of the video. On part of the reason why I'm going to do it. You know how when you dye your hair, you can kind of see it change. So um, let me know how it goes. Okay, so you know I told you that the this um, stable whatever. Um, this stuff is, I told you that it was expired, I think, um, and so if I do, if I do f my hair up in any way, and, or whatever, I can always dye it again, you know, so it's not like it's that big of a deal, kind of, but, so I've got it mixed together, the two, Okay, so I have this camera at an angle because it's on in my bathroom, and I have it on a stand, and I have um, you know the little thing sticking up or holding it to the side at a slant. All right, I keep messing up my phone because I keep hitting the lock button. I keep trying to remember to look at the actual camera itself and not the screen, but um. Here we go! Wish me luck, y'all. Alright, thought I would have to go somewhere for this. Alright. I'm supposed to do my roots first, because obviously it's a lot darker. Alright, 25 minutes. I have gotten chemical burns from putting too much on the actual scalp, because I have trichotillomania and there's a lot of scalp, so I have to be very careful in that. But, um, yeah. So, I'm going to use this mirror over here to kind of show me what I'm doing. And I'm going to use this tube. Y'all are going to like the wig that I have. It's got dark brown or light brown roots. Kind of make it look more natural. Not too much on there. Woo! Glad I got a fan on in here. I'm just gonna use my hand. I can get it better on, until, like, I need to not use the fan. But, you know, all the hair up here. I mean, it's not gonna be so bad when I, you know, put it all up like this. But, um, yeah. Alright, now I can just squat down a little. Um, I've gotten the courage to do this and finally show, you know, all my friends from back home and, and my family who's never seen me this bad with it, but I got the courage to do this from seeing uh, beautiful women like me um, show their trichotillomania and not be so ashamed. And I've been ashamed and afraid of it, you know, my whole life, and I've missed out a lot because of it. So uh, maybe if um, I share more, Maybe that'll help me beat this. So, um, not only that, but I want to get this bracelet called the King Bracelet. And they're doing a giveaway thing, and you have to, you know, tell them what you're going to do with it, what's, what your what your daily life is with trichotillomania, or nail biting, or skin picking, and then why you need it. You know, the, the circumstances on why you can't afford it. 
A, it's 150 bucks, and B, I don't have a job. Our house is in full, full the foreclosure because the bank has been shysty on on stuff, and the reason is because our property is worth about half a million bucks, and we only owe just over, just under two. Yeah, it's four hundred thousand. Anyways, it's we only have just under two hundred thousand uh, to pay. So. You do the math and you can tell that they would be making a lot of money because, you know, they wouldn't let us pay and, you know, y'all read my blogs. If you haven't, go read my blogs because I'm not going to go all through that right now because I put that in my blogs. It's on my website. Websites, you know what it is. It's right there. But, um, back to this. It's looking good. You know, I want to make sure I get it on there thick, but then I don't, I mean, I don't want to run out because... We can sit together. See, it's about halfway down that I need to get it done because that's how far my hair is grown. Or whatever. We meant to be in the great outdoor. Can't forget about Brown's ears. My video is gonna look so weird because I keep forgetting to squat. Say what? Squat! <laughs> but yeah, don't forget to um, to try to comment if you can remember what that dude's name is from that Christmas movie that is the fire and ha and has the spiky red hair that I showed that kind of looked like me when I had my hair upside down. <laughs> it's just funny. I love that those Christmas movies. Watch them all the time growing up every Christmas I would watch those old timey claymation Christmas movies I try to watch them with my kid but he doesn't like them or doesn't seem to care this year might be different though okay I think that's good for the root part <laughs> I look funny in the great outdoors alright oh man that does go weird I don't know about that I haven't done very many YouTube videos, okay? And, um, we all look different and we all have our demons and, and things that we can't control or, you know, whatever. Mine just happens to be something that I didn't even know there was a name for and I thought I really was the only one in the world when I was a kid. And so, I've been too embarrassed to even talk about it. And, you know, I feel very proud that I'm even doing this, you know. It's the part of hit and upload that I'm probably going to be the scared, scaredest part of the whole thing. You can make videos and it can be easy, you know, but it's like... When you upload, when you hit that upload button, it's like, boom, everybody knows now. It's like, are people going to look at me different? You know, it scares me. It really, really scares me. Because there's a lot of people out there that they don't know what you're going through and they don't give a crap. And they'll just be mean and be trolly and, you know. It's like, but y'all probably go through through things too, and then of course then you've got those people that are perfect. Okay, sorry, not everybody's perfect, unfortunately, but now you can tell it is way, way different now that my hair is wet. I know exactly how much, how bad my trick is. No eyelashes. So awful. Alright, so we're gonna see y'all in about 20-ish minutes. I'll see y'all in about 20-ish minutes and we'll do the rest. So I even moved the camera up and I wish I would have done this from the beginning to be honest because now I don't have to squat down. So at least the second part of this when I do my, you know, the bottom part, it's going to be better angled, that is. I think it's been me a lot of time, like I said. I wanted to try to do a different, better angle. Like I said, 
I suck at making videos. I'm still not very good at it. And I'm using my phone. Can't forget to do the eyebrows too. The tiny little eyebrows that I overplug all the time. So let's do it. tricks for people who don't know or read my blogs there on, my, on this website. <laughs> you know, because I get a lot of hits on it. But, um, and maybe I guess people read them, maybe they just click on it and go to another one. But, uh, nobody ever comments on them. You know, I mean, I don't, I'm not honestly don't know if you need to be a member to, um, so, uh, if anybody finds that out and that is the case, you let me know, I guess, on, on this video. I don't like it. I think my hair might end up turning a little red. up in this hair bun thingy. Now we do the eyebrows. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> An obvious oh that burns. Burns, burns, burns. I gotta go get some paint something for it. Oh, try not to get it on the skin. I got it on my forehead. Like I said, I don't have very thick eyebrows. Alright, I'm gonna use this. <laughs> Y'all comment below. Tell me what, please tell me what, if, if any, what I know I'm, uh, of course I'm gonna mistake. So tell me what I'm doing wrong, because I'll probably end up doing this again. Especially after, um, I do have sticker hair for not pulling. So, any advice on doing this better next time? I would love to know. Let's remove the excess that I have on my skin where it's burning like heck. Okay, so the time is about up. I'm letting let me go a little bit longer. There's my little chitlin. <laughs> and <laughs> Oh, I am posting. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. <laughs> anyway. We're supposed to be doing homework and his hands started hurting. He's trying to He's trying to video bomb me. Anyways. This is the head and I'm out of it. He goes that far for the clip. <laughs> Our stairs that are three stairs. Anyways, like I was saying. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't look like that it's turning blonde like I want to. It's not turning blonde like I want to. Guys, it's not it's turning red. So it was a... What the? I'm out of here. <laughs> now I'm in here. Again. 
you know what I'm gonna do? That's what he was doing. That's what that crazy ball was doing. If I get a school, I'm going to get one like that. It doesn't really look like my eyebrows are really too so much color. So I think I'm gonna let this stay in just a little bit longer. Wish I had a better voice. But I sing again. Apparently people tell me I sing through my nose and you're supposed to sing through your stomach or like how you talk. But this is how I know how to sing. Why don't you sing with me? And it's not good. From a double behind. <laughs> From a double behind. That doesn't, I mean, it kind of looks a little brown, but it's like a dark brown. And I put, I knew I should have put some, a lot more of that, um, that stuff I told y'all about. Looks wrong. Hey, you know what? This might actually look good. But I'm totally going to let it go more because it is not... <laughs> hey, so it is time. I finally got to see it. It is not blonde. Not blonde at all. Oh, so sweet. But I bet y'all want to see it. Before I do, since I already told you it's not blonde, comment below. What do you think it came out to be? Since I did want it to be blonde, and I had pretty dark hair to begin with, um, I'm gonna give you all a few seconds before I take this thing off. And let me know. Comment below. Come on. Oh, by the way, yeah, this is my son's towel. I don't know what it is. I think it's a. Um, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. <laughs> okay, what did y'all think? Did y'all think it was going to be a dark blonde? Light brown? It is a um, strawberry blonde. Or whatever. Now let's put this way. See in the mirror. Still, even with the lighter hair, the bald spots are still pretty visible. My hair is kind of damp. But you know what? I actually like this color a lot, even though it's not blonde. I thought I was just shooting this and it was not going. But so here it is on the single. What do y'all think? At least, you know, you don't see the gray hairs anymore. You know, because, like, I would pull out gray hairs first because they'd get on my nerves and they steamed out. But, um, I guess now they're blonde. <laughs> if they are. I know I still have some. Because I was up yesterday. And then my eyebrows, you know, I, I try to get it all over, but <laughs> look at that. <laughs> they're not all blonde. It's not so. I, I like this color, you know, with the trick being as bad as it is. 
I like this color in the dark than my regular dark hair anyways. I'm just not a big fan of dark hair on me. I don't know. But um yeah. So here's an, you know, another view on the badness of the trick. I think it kinda hides it a little better. What do you think? I don't know. My hair is red. Look, I mean, my scalp's red. That, my friend, is from leaving it on like way, way longer than I was supposed to. Burn, um, so it irritated my scalp a little bit, I would say. I don't think that's from me pulling. So. Yeah. It's very soft, like I said. Ooh. So well, let's look at the back now that I got it up. Oh my gosh, it's streaked. <laughs> what? It looks streaked. Oh my goodness, let's let's zoom in. That's funny. I don't think that's just the lighting. Oh, maybe it is just the lighting a little. I love this hair color. Either way. Alright. This is by far the hardest video yet to post live on YouTube. Not hiding under my hats or bandanas and finally showing everyone the true nature of my trick, at its worst right now. But I have not given up hope on beating this thing once and for all. Thanks again for watching. Subscribe if you haven't and like this video because it was a hard one for me. Till next time. Also, check out my other videos and stop by my website where all my YouTube videos are available.